The latest generation laptops equipping the newer Intel 12th Gen and the Ryzen 6000 series CPUs have been recent choices for higher performance driven gaming notebooks that never fails to handle your gaming tasks smooth and quick. These latest gaming devices provide powerful performance, and the newer specs ensures a future proof solution for new buyers. But, this laptops remain to be an confused option for people looking for affordable budget gaming notebooks. So, while listing out such budget laptop options with great performance rates combined with affordability, it was found that the HP Victus 16, the Lenovo Itapad Gaming 3, and the MSI GF63 Thin Gaming laptops have been three of our top considerations. So, in this video, we compare this three budget gaming laptops with favorable price range and sort out the best option suitable for you. Starting up with the display comparison, the 15.6-inch screen in the MSI GF63 Thin seems to be a most favorable option for gamers, as it would offer you an 144Hz refresh rate screen, combined with 62% of sRGB coverage, but with a downside of dimmer screen, with an peak brightness only around 250 nits. While the Itapad 3 offer an all-rounder display experience, where the price-to-performance ratio if balanced with 63% sRGB coverage, 120Hz refresh rate, with the peak brightness falling around 270 nits, and records slightly better response rates. The Victa 16 comes with a 16-inch screen which takes the least preference in terms of display, as it packs only 60Hz refresh rate screen, which makes it less likely for gaming, although it offer the same display with 62% sRGB and 250 nits peak brightness, expected at this price segment. Next, moving on to the CPU comparison, the MSI GF63 here comes with the Intel i5-11400H processor, which is a Hexa core chip with 6 core 12 threads, with 2.7 GHz base clock, and up to 4.5 GHz boost clock speeds, that comes with a 35W TDP limit. This chip was tested with different benchmarking tests, based on which, it managed to bring in up to 20 points, as its overall score. Whereas, the Itapad 3 and the Victus 16 comes with the AMD Ryzen 5 5600H processor, which is also an Hexa core chip, with 3.3 GHz base clock and up to 4.2 GHz boost clock speeds, and reports 45 Watt TDP limit. This chip was recorded with 19.5 points as the overall score, based on our different benchmark tests. So, on comparison, the Intel 11400H chip in the MSI GF63 brings in up to 15% better performance compared to the 5600H processor in terms of single-core gaming performance, while the 5600H in the Victus and Itapad offers 5-10% to better performance in terms of the multi-core driven workloads. Next, talking about the GPU performance, all the three laptops are equipped with different GPUs with 4GB graphics memory. The Itapad 3 here comes equipped with an GTX 1650 card, while the MSI GF63 packs the newer RTX 3050 with 40 watt TGP limit, and the Victus 16 packs the AMD's Radeon RX 5500M graphics card. These three GPUs were tested with games at different settings and compared, based on which, we observed that the RTX 3050 and the MSI GF63 Thin managed to bring up to 10 to 15% boost when compared to the GTX 1650 in the Itapad Gaming 3. While we found no considerable difference when the RTX 3050 was compared with the AMD Radeon RX 5500M graphics in the Victus 16. So, you can expect quite similar performance with both the GPUs on board. Next, speaking of the battery performance, the 70 watt hour battery in the Victus 16 becomes a clear winner here, which offers around 7 to 8 hours of battery backup on normal usage like video playback and web browsing, and up to 2 hours of gaming. The Itapad 3 on the other hand, comes with a 45 watt hour battery option, which lasts around 5 to 6 hours of normal usage, and up to 1 hour of gaming. The MSI GF63 packs a 51 watt hour battery, which lasts 4 to 5 hours of normal usage, and less than 1 hour of gaming. So, you might frequently want to plug in the battery while using the Itapad 3, and MSI's GF63 more importantly. Next, speaking of thermals, the maximum CPU temperatures in the Itapad Gaming 3 is recorded as 88 degrees. Whereas the temperatures in the MSI GF63 were also under limit, where the maximum CPU temperatures reached around 85 degrees. And the Victus 16 records a maximum CPU temperature of 90 degrees Celsius. So, the thermal performance in all the three laptops are under control, and it is less expected to have any serious heating or thermal throttling issues. Finally, speaking of the memory and storage section, all the three laptops has 8GB DDR4 RAM memory capacity and 512GB of SSD type storage. So, overall, based on our comparison, the MSI GF63 Thin with a good CPU and GPU combination packed with 144Hz refresh rate screen, with just a little compromise of lower battery backup, is a good option to consider in the lower budget segment of gaming laptops, based on the current offer.
whereas, the Victa 16 and Itapad 3 are also good options to consider when are available at a cheaper price, where you can expect to have a good device that can handle your multitasking and day-to-day -day tasks smooth and offer you with a decent gaming performance. Thank you, if you ended up liking the video, please do not forget to like the video and subscribe the channel.